All right, so to start things off, now that I can record my own Let's Plays, uh, I don't know if you can hear it. You might be able to hear my squeaky ass bed. This is as far away uh, from the computer that the headset will reach. So, without further ado, I start our first Halloween related Let's Plays in Layers of Fear. So, I've watched a Let's Play before, uh, Layers of Fear, and because of my, uh, Rooster Teeth sponsorship, I'll definitely be checking out, uh, I want to say it's called Backwards Compatible now, I'm not 100% sure, I watched them when it was sponsored play. <coughs> Layers of Fear is an immersive game experience in which every decision affects the narrative as in life it is the doors you open the memories you take with you and the shadows you explore that will define what you are this may be our game but it is your journey okay um subtitles are on I don't care uh, don't care. I don't care. As long as subtitles are on, I really don't care. It seems like a really cool game from what I've watched in Let's Plays and stuff. Um, but I guess I'll find out how really scary this game is. Uh... <clears throat> I'm thinking from now on I'll do like 30 minute videos for Let's Plays. Because I think that would make a good amount for Let's Plays. Um, like I said, I watched uh, Achievement Hunter play this game. And I have now put out the cigarette I was smoking a minute ago 15 fucking times. I didn't want to smoke during the fucking let's play. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You well, yeah, I always feel that way. But even for you, there is still a way. Okay. A way to bring it all back. Yeah? Are you fucking serious? The one precious thing you ever truly desired. I don't think we're talking about the same thing. Finish it. I really don't think we're talking about the same thing. So there's one thing I desire. It's definitely not what you're saying. Because I know this is uh, a painting game where I paint stuff. Right trigger, okay. I hit every other button. Down on a dark and stormy day, our three little rascals chanced for to stray. Chanced for to stray? Chanced for to stray. I don't understand what that means. Uh... Was this like a muzzle? Okay. So far, not that scary. Can't go through that door. Hey, booties. Oh, I wonder. Can I flip around this picture? Nope. Nope. Cannot flip around the picture. Alright.
hold right trigger and move it. Okay. And AF of L. As fuck of life? Okay. And artist triumph. Gallery opening wows critics. Some call him the new... I can't pronounce that word. Others compare him to... Don't know how to pronounce that either. And one awestruck critic who wished to remain unnamed went as far, went as, far as to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo. Anyway, you slice it, the exhibition proved an immense success. Somebody scratched out some shit. Distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiance. Looking stunning in her black gown, Blank revealed to us exclusively that the couple are indeed expecting, what, a child? I could have, I didn't realize I could, fuck you. I'll just, I read it that way for no reason. Dear sir, would you like to, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. Sorry, I looked at the capture for a second. Uh, I forgot where I was. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to act further than a prophylactic spraying. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pest Pacification Co. Pesky Pets Pacification Co. That is... That's a cool company name. I don't care if you don't think it is. All right, let's drink the whiskey. What kind of game is this? It won't even let me drink whiskey. Shit, my own family will let me drink me let me drink whiskey. They'll drink with me. Okay, so it's scratched out face. It's torn in half and blood on it. Cool. <laughs> Why would it let me open it if I can't do anything with it? Weird that I have to like... I have like control over how far I open things. I hope that's not like something I'm gonna have to use later. I kind of remember the let's play I watched for this and it let me open everything on there and I couldn't use any of it. Thank you prick. Dog collar. I cannot read anything besides pop coal. Okay. I kind of want to explore this room a little bit more before I wander off into any other rooms. Like, what's in this drawer? Apparently, nothing. Apparently, nothing.
so I want to say I'm the artist that is like freaking out about his paintings or whatever. And that one's locked. Okay, the first thing that is locked. Not opening that door. Nothing down there. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop, just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Okay. Where the fuck's my office? I'm gonna go into the kitchen. Uh, that looked kind of promising. Okay. Figured you'd be up all night, so I made you a little treat. You know, I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and snored his head off like the rest of the common folk. I know, gasp, in other words, get some sleep, you big dummy. I love you. Somebody cares about me. My hand weighs something. Okay. See, I didn't realize those were cabinets right there. I thought since they're all made out of metal, you know, that's where you can put stuff to cook food. I'm like, holy shit, this place has a lot of ovens. It doesn't have a lot of ovens, it just has a lot of, uh... Crap, where you can put other crap. There's like not a whole bunch for me to read. Paint, rose door, burnt umber, sienna, brushes, 25 brushes, air fresheners, 50 pack, 10 kilograms of apples, and 30 booze. I can hang out with you. I'm cool with eating apples and drinking a lot. Like, that's the dream, right? To eat your fill of apples and drink a lot while painting pictures? That's probably somebody's dream. I won't bash that dream just because I don't like it. But I bet you that's somebody's, like, actual dream. Just to paint pictures, drink, and eat apples. weirdly dark room with ooh spices more apples garlic corn herbs not the herb that you smoke what you went there no way <laughs> okay I may have Zoned out for a second, started talking. Uh, let's check the bathroom. Rat poison contains antu. What the fuck is Antu? Effective when used as a bait poison, water poison, tracking poison, active ingredients, alpha nephelion 3, uh, 20%. Inert ingredients, diatomaceous start, start. Okay, the only reason I understand diatomaceous is because we had a slight bad bug infestation in my house. And diatomaceous is diatomaceous earth. It's like this white powdery shit. And you wouldn't think it would be that effective against like bed bugs or bugs in general. Because it literally looks like flour. 
it feels like flour when you rub it between your fingers too but you put some of it on a bug and it's like really fine uh something it's like really fine like shards of something and they like break through shell of bugs really easily um color pigment water beta naphthilion theracene theria <sighs> okay i was expecting there'd be like more in this room I think I need a mop. The sink's full of water. The floor's covered in water. The bathtub is the only place not full of water. <clears throat> I'd rather have my water in the bathtub than on the floor. Achilles Prosthetics Co. One below knee prosthesis. How the hell did they fuck up the length? Somebody lost a leg in the war of 1912. Yeah, I'm just leaving lights on wherever I go so I know where I was. Didn't notice this earlier. Okay, I don't know what the fuck that noise was. Got a rat problem? Call us now at... I can't... Got a little Vinny Partners. Got a rat problem? Call us now at... Forget, forget about it. Okay. Uh, yeah, that looked like a, like a, like a, it looked like an F and an A at the start of Forget About It, so I thought it was trying to say something else and I didn't really want to say it, but I guess I like inadvertently said it anyway, because I can't stop from talking right now. Dude, I haven't seen a mousetrap like that in forever. Oh, that's what the noise was. I stepped on a shit ton of mouse traps. I mean, if the end game of this is a bunch of mouse fucking eating my face, sure, why not? Oh, dude, really? I didn't expect to get to the basement already. In the Let's Play I watched for this, they didn't go to the basement until like Endgame. So I hope me getting here early doesn't like fuck up anything. Okay. Door's locked. Violin. Kinda like wanna jam out real quick and just fucking smash it or something. Is there a run option? lights down here oh my god are you serious are you serious really I just accidentally skipped over the fucking light switches okay let's see what the fuck okay that's just creepy 
I don't care who the fuck you are. That's creepy. And there's broken bottles over here. Okay. Yeah, this is a creepy house already. And I haven't even gotten to, like, the psychological thriller aspect of this. The thing I don't like is how fucking slow it is to walk up these stairs. I need the key, which is in my room. Okay. Been working all night, don't wake me up. Okay, there's blood all over the floor. Let's stay away from the bloody floor. What the fuck was that noise? Let's go to our daughter's room. I don't know why mommy's all scratched out, but that's cool, right? I don't know, I'm like at 20 minutes right now, and since nothing really scary's happened yet, I'm kind of tempted to see something scary will happen in like the next... Uh... Like next eight minutes if nothing scary happens I'll just make this like 45 minutes long so that door is locked let's go with this door and now I'm in my office Okay. So that's where the key is. But I don't want the key. I want to see what this is. Sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. Alright. Wife. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now. I really do. That's why I have agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old time's sake, I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this, and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brickstone, Whispered Tale Publishing House. I mean, if it is for like little kids, like bedtime story type shit, uh, you, you guy, you kind of have to, like, keep it tame. Okay, that's not bad. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. That's... Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Seriously? How do you not notice blood? How did you not notice the blood? It's like... Oh, my God. You drew this for a fucking bedtime story oh god oh oh that's creepy yeah you're never fucking drawing my kids a picture knock you the fuck out if you do creep wonder if there's like a light switch in here or something now I'm locked in with myself. I don't know what that noise was. Go for one of the 
But came out more of a. <laughs> true story behind the picture of Dorian Gray. Was it true all along? <sighs> I don't know. Uh, if it was true, then he was immortal because of his picture. If it wasn't true, it was just a fucking picture. I mean, if it was true, uh, I'll go try and draw a picture of myself right now and fucking live forever. Because that was the thing, right? He could live forever through his picture. Okay. He could live forever through his picture. Because everything that he did to himself, whether it was like alcohol or drugs, or he could have straight up been murdered or something, it all happened to the picture and not him. Somebody could have like shot him in the head and there'd be a bullet hole where like a painted on bullet hole in his picture. All right, so 26 minutes of filler and bullshit at the beginning of this while I find out that my character has some issues. He drinks a lot. He makes paintings. Somebody has a prosthetic arm or leg. No, leg. Okay. Okay, so these are like all old used paint brushes, but there's like a good chunk of these that are just straight up snapped in half. Get it right this time. <clears throat> the painting? Uh, sure. I've got all the liquor I need. A lot of liquor. <laughs> this guy knows how to party. Uh, I'm hoping something will be in one of these drawers. Nope. Awesome. I'm tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sakes. Come talk to me when you when you when when you're done before you go go to sleep. Okay, so I stutter sometimes, mostly when I'm reading stuff or when I'm got a lot of thoughts going on in my brain and I'm trying to get them out fast. This is usually when I stutter. Lost it. You deserve finish it. What did I lose? What do I deserve? What do I need to finish? Okay. It's up for a reason. <sighs> Is it covered for a reason and I shouldn't like have done something I've literally checked everything in here that was about the scariest thing that happened right there I'm somewhere else now Dorian Gray how's it hanging Holmes um, we're at like a half hour and there's nothing really scary that's happened so far. So I'm going to go 45 minutes. So you got like another 15 minutes of this bullshit. While I try and figure my way out around. Wait, is there like a light switch in here or something? Boom. 
There's always a light switch. Even if this is 1912, there's a light switch. Just out of reach. Cool. Saw that coming. Now, just so you know, I'm not talking smack about the game. I just watched other people play this game before. There's nothing to do in here. I wonder if that painting looked like that before. I know the paintings in this game can change, too. Everything in this can change. In a heartbeat. In a second. In a glance. In a look. Going in circles. Dear sir and madam, we must kindly, albeit strongly, sir, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your marital problems, while regrettable, are a private matter and should remain that way. They are certainly of no concern to us and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us have to get up early and work for a living. <coughs> we must also warn you that if things continue the way they are now, we will be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbors. I'm sorry, very tired neighbors. Uh, I don't know about you, but if, like, I mean, I understand the people that live next door to me are, like, old, like, retired in their, like, 70s or 80s old. Uh, but if, like, I heard them yelling and screaming at each other, I'd only let it go so long before I, like, walk over and ask them, like, hey... Okay, I found a picture. Cool. Uh, some girl at like a piano. I didn't 100% look at the picture. Before I leave. Okay. I was just wondering if any of the paintings have changed yet. There's like a really creepy one later on with a dog. Bank. If I remember right, the shit in this game that uh, you can like pick up for your painting, it's usually some fucked up shit. Nothing. Nothing written on you either. Apparently I like... Five, four, eight. Five. Four, eight. The pass holds back. Look closer. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Okay, uh, I was hoping I'd get to pick that up, but I guess not. <clears throat> and there's now a doorway here. Did I like walk by another light switch or something? Because this room is dark. 
Alright, let's keep going forward. 35 minutes. <clears throat> um, I do have to, like, uh, clear up the phlegm in my throat a lot. I smoke a lot. You've been snooping around my workshop again for the last time. You are not allowed in that room, even if the door happens to be open. I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Okay. So I snooped around and you want to fire me. Understandable. I wouldn't like people looking in my shit either. That's why when it's off limits, nobody looks at it. Wander. Took a thousand steps. Okay. I've gotten a lot of achievements in like the last five seconds. Um, that's wood. I'd rather light up this room a bit before I start fucking with anything. Well, okay then. Didn't expect that to happen. Who the fuck has a trap door in their house? Fucking crazy people. Dust mice, even in my lungs, grotesque vermin dirt, there is always more. I like some of his drawings, they do look cool, they're just kind of fucked up. The artist's impression, collect a rat sketch. Okay, so there's like collectibles in this game, I guess. Just so you know, I'm playing through this game like once. If I play through it a second time, someone else is going to be playing it for me. Oh, it's supposed to be like a light. I just wanted to know where the fucking light switch was. And all of a sudden, I got dropped into the goddamn basement. Spin it faster. Spin it faster. Spin it faster. Why is my character just like looking away? Faster and faster, we can do it. I was hoping that would do something like interact with the game in a way. And I wish these lights were stronger. Also, that's not a painting, that's literally just a doll. Another bust. It's so busty. Ha ha ha. Shut up, I'm funny. Okay, what the fuck do I do in this room? Do I do the moose? The moose? The moose? Did I light myself on fire? Something to do with that box, that bottle, the moose. I know it's a deer, but I kept calling it moose for a minute. Okay. I'm leaving that room. Paint deep lies. 
what happens if I go backwards? I was hoping more paintings would fly off the wall. Show me like some real terror, some real fear. Okay, I'm like at the 45 minute mark and nothing like terrifyingly scary has happened so far. I don't like the rats. <coughs> I'm not a big fan of rats in general. Ever since... Creepy. Okay, I jumped a little bit. Okay, that got me. That got me. Um... I suppose I probably should have turned around more. I just wanted to see if another painting in the room had changed. So we're leaving. <coughs> Let's leave the room and go into this room. Where there's more room to be room. Yeah, I can't tell if that's the noise of, like, supposed to be wind or something, or what, but, uh, I don't really, like, see anything in here that I can use for anything. Maybe on, like, this table back here, there's, like, a candle behind that curtain. Nope, can't use the curtain. We're all fucked and it's overrated. I feel I'm gonna be sick. In the end, it's your fault. Hello? It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? No. I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times. And yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Okay. Okay. Looks like I'm going that way. Unless this door is open now. Nope. Cool. Let's go into this creepy room. Be scares. Yay. What the fuck? Sh like straight up shut off the light and walk through here in the dark. Just let every creepy crawly thing just kill you. I mean, I feel like that's already gonna happen. This house was like nowhere close to this big fucking half hour ago. I can't believe I've already spent over a half hour playing this game. Don't know if that was like a collectible room or a scary room. There's some of these rooms here that don't really have anything going on in them. Yo, I made it to the kitchen. Nice. Which means if I go this way, I'm back into the hallway. Nope.
Okay. Painting, maybe? Okay. Okay. You can stop now. Yay, there's no fruit in the painting. But look at all the wonderful fruit we have. This game is creepy and I don't like it. I'm going out this door. Goodbye. Oh. Why? I don't want to deal with your nightmare shit anymore. First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. Oh god. I had to find a knife. I didn't Not I was hoping that wasn't like real flesh. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Sick fuck. This helped keep my hand steady. Oh god. Oh, you are so fucking disgusting, you know that? Can I leave now? Like, I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, cool. We're finally getting close to the end. My collectibles that I've got in. Look at that, I think I missed a bunch of shit. Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over the hump. So, what's so hard about it? I've got my apples. Okay, so we got what looks like some trees over here like a lake some grass maybe a building and some red shit let's add this piece of human flesh and hey fucking bloody flamingos and this is open first I looked for a canvas not just any canvas I had to find a knife not of one of those red ones it needed to be as sharp as a razor so I used a razor in fact and I carefully flayed the skin booze helped me keep my hands steady dude is creepy as fuck shapeless dreams I'm gonna call that good for right now it's like 50 minutes long uh, I found some stuff and I made this uh, I don't know if I'll play another part of this if I do ill because cause somebody tells me to if not uh, there's another game on here called the Turing test I don't know if it's a scary game but we'll play it it's free for this month of October on Xbox Live so who knows Airborne was also free for this month and I played that one after I posted that video yesterday um, it was cool don't get me wrong it was just there were a few times where the game started to piss me off and then it really started to piss me off about the time I stopped playing airborne yesterday not this is like after I recorded and everything uh, something may have happened somebody may have rage quit to the point where he deleted the game uh, we won't point fingers at anybody 
but there is only one person in this room, and that's me, so fuck you, asshole. I'm an asshole, not you. When I call somebody an asshole in these videos, unless there's another person with me, I'm calling myself an asshole. Alright, so I'm going to call that good and done.